Sure. And let's turn to some other medical news now. A recent test at three local middle schools show 40% of kids had eye coordination problems that could not be detected by regular tests. Now, in some cases, these kids slip under the radar. They're thought to be bad students or delinquents. The real problem is their eyesight. Now a nonprofit is trying to change that. We were very poor, very, very poor. Reading is essential to a child's schooling. But many children cannot read. In some cases, it's not that they're not smart. It's because they have undetected vision problems, according to Maureen Powers of Gemstone. We define the problem as the inability to coordinate the two eyes and the uh, well enough and the inability to track across a page. They will see words wiggle, jump, or float. This has a tremendous impact on how they learn. If unaddressed, many children simply slip under the radar and are labeled as bad students. The organization called Gemstone Foundation goes into low-income schools such as Ann Street Middle School and trains the kids to use their eyes in the most efficient way. Using a computer program and 3D glasses, the program takes them through various vision exercises. Think of it as gymnastics for the eyes. They're training to be able to look far away and near rapidly, so looking at the board, uh, the, say the blackboard and the their book. They're uh, training to track, um, so moving their eyes rapidly and accurately around, around the screen, and they're training to converge their eyes appropriately at the plane of the paper. The kids say it's helped. When I read, I kind of struggle in words because I can't really see it, but when I started doing this, um, I, I stopped struggling. On Saturday afternoon, I picked up... And the reading scores verify what they say. Recent results show big improvements. 80% of the children improved an average of over 12 words per minute. I tried to look at the board and I couldn't see that much. But now that I'm doing this program, I can see from the back now.